what really bothers me, and this is my rant, what really fucking bothers me is that for the last two months, I have sat by in Gamergate and I have watched false faux victims utilize the world for their own personal and profit aims claiming victimhood over emails and over comments on Twitter. And here you have a woman who's a real victim of a real rape and a real assault, and those same women who claim that they care about women's rights have done nothing. They have done jack fucking shit. And that pisses me off. And earlier I tweeted to Anita Sarkeesian, and I said, can you help? Radio fucking silence. And you know what makes me mad? And this is why I am so pissed off at modern feminists. They claim to care about women, but when there are actually women in need, what do they do? Fucking radio silence. They don't give a shit about anybody but themselves. Anita Sarkeesian has made hundreds of thousands of dollars peddling her bullshit faux video, socially damaging crap. And it has been damaging for gender relations and it has been damaging for women. And I don't even want to hear about her victimhood because Cytheria, she's a real victim. A real victim of a random rape and assault. And you know, anybody who even dares insinuate that a sex worker doesn't deserve the same type of defense because, of, because they work in sex work can go fuck themselves. And that's what I have to say, and that's why I am so fucking livid right now. And I'm hoping that this video wakes some of them up, because if these mainstream media outlets, you know, we've talked about ethics and journalism and Gamergate, and everyone said, that's bullshit, that's a cover for, for the abuse of women. And you know what I say? Fuck you. Because you know what? Right now, mainstream media is not covering Cytheria. They're not. They're, they're covering, they've created this, this straw man bullshit ad hominem belief system that, oh, you know what, it's, it's men and gaming. It's, it's all the, the male gamers that are the misogynists and the damaging people in society. You know what, fuck you. You want to do some actual reporting? Why don't you take a look at why these repeat offender juvenile delinquents are out of prison and able to break into people's homes? And guess what? It wasn't just Cytheria's home. They caught them because they did it again the next night. That's the fucking problem in this country. You want to talk about violence against women? Why aren't we looking at that? Why aren't we looking at gaps in the prison systems? Why aren't we looking at, 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 at all of these other societal issues? No, you know what? We're going to pick a group of benign people who enjoy uh, a gaming as a, as, a, as a hobby, and we're going to paint, and we're going to smear them and make them the horrible, horrible abusers of women. And it makes me so mad that these people utilize victimhood. Brianna Wu, Anita Sarkeesian. Yeah, you know, I mean, that, that, that blue-haired girl talking about being abused and, and oppressed on Twitter. You know who is abused? Cytheria. You know who's abused? There are Christy Mack. There are tons of women that I can name off the top of my hand, this is what feminism should be about. Feminism should be about supporting those women and supporting women who have faced real abuse and real hardship. And I don't even want to hear this idea that these bullshit videos are in some way helping women. Get off of it. This is a big fucking profiteering scheme and they know it. And this is the reason, you know, right now, I swear to God, I would give my skin so that say, Theory wouldn't have to experience that in her home with her children. And these women who are making a ton of fucking money peddling their victimhood haven't given any of it back. They can't even deliver their DVDs on schedule. And you're going to tell me that they're the victims of society? And we have a media that enables this? There's something seriously wrong. Seriously wrong. I am so disappointed right now. I'm so disappointed in Rolling Stone for running articles, ruining some young man's life without fact-checking, where are they? And thank God, you know, thank God for Cytheria's fans and that there are people who are supporting her. And I know she didn't ask me to do this video. These are just my thoughts about this. But I am so tired of the hypocrisy. And I am so tired of having to defend a group of, of really benign, kind people from this corrupt media structure 
that they've created to, to profiteer off of faux victimhood. They don't want to look at real victimhood because it's ugly and it's scary and it's horrible and it's unpredictable. So let's instead focus on, on emails and tweets. <sighs> you know, I, I really think that so much of it has to do with the fact that these people who are peddling their faux victimhood have no idea what it's like to be an actual hardship. So for everybody, I ask that everyone just do what they can, take care of each other. Because it's very, very clear at this point that the media is not going to tell you the truth and that we have to care for one another. <laughs> the, the structure right now of social support is skewed. It is so skewed. They're throwing money at people who are, who are useless and who are narcissists and con men who have well-constructed videos so that they can guilt people into giving them money. And you know, people who really need the help are so fucking traumatized that they can't even begin to think like that. I, I was chatting with Cytheria earlier. She's afraid to leave her house. She's afraid to leave her home. Her kids were in that house. And, and the stories of the Brianna Woos and the Anita Sarkeesians, really, truly, wake the fuck up. And to all of you who've been supporting that shit, wake the fuck up. And it's not just Cytheria. There are people every fucking day in this world who are suffering. And we're worried about man-spreading. And we're worried about inequity of, of, of bathrooms at sports stadiums. Wake the fuck up. I am so sick of it. I am so tired of this. So open your eyes. <laughs>